what areas intellectually, uh, now as a Christian um, and as a scientist, do you personally still wrestle with intellectually? Uh, to kind of, do you feel the tension of your own faith and your academic pursuits? Well, I think there are many uh, hard questions in life, and those are the questions that we each of us wrestle with. If it comes to intellectual questions, I think one of the toughest questions uh, arises in the form, if there is a loving God, omnipotent uh, and all-knowing, how come there's so much suffering in the world? So this is the, the problem of suffering or the problem of pain. Why doesn't that loving God simply overcome that suffering? I think that's one of the hardest questions. It's not, it's not the, the most personal question for me. I'm, I mean, I'm a fortunate person. I'm, I've got my health. I've, I've lived a, a, a comfortable life by the standards of most humans. So I'm not complaining, but, I'm, but I bet there are people out there in the audience who are suffering. And th this is a live question for you. Um, it, why am I suffering? Where is God in this? If there is a loving God, why doesn't he make it go away? I think that's one of the hardest questions. I think it, I, I think it hasn't got a clear and, 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 and glib answer. I think there are some answers to that question. I don't think it's unanswerable. I think one answer to the question, for example, is that if you think about this in, the, in terms of the problem of pain, if you think about pain, pain is unpleasant and, and, and you know, we think of it as bad, but actually pain it plays an incredibly important role in our lives. We feel pain when we're damaging ourselves, and if we don't feel that pain, then we won't withdraw our hand from the hot plate or whatever it might be. So actually pain, suffer, suffering in that sense, um, serves a very important purpose in our lives. And I think that's one answer to the problem of pain and suffering. And um, another answer to the problem of pain and suffering is that this question is, well, why doesn't God do something about it, do something about the, all the suffering there is in the world? Well, the Christian would say God has done something about it. The Christian would say God actually um, took this problem so seriously that he came himself in the person of his son, Jesus Christ, and he lived and suffered and died. Um, to be part of this suffering and to redeem that suffering. And that's, what, that's another part of the answer to that question. For more information about the Veritas Forum, including additional recordings and a calendar of upcoming events, please visit our website at veritas.org.